I'm back. Then I'm gone. Then I'm back. Then I'm gone. Then I'm back. You get the idea. Hey guys, glad to see you again. So, this video is to address the elephant in the room. No, Herschel, shut up! Not you! It's a metaphorical elephant. So, I've been... gone. For the last couple weeks. <laughs> Honestly, I didn't really explain why. And... I don't know why I thought that the video that I put out would have sufficed. I really don't know how to uh, go into details. It's... There's a lot of stuff going on that I really don't want to share too much of. But... That's not going to help you guys out either. And I did promise that I would make this video and give a proper explanation. At the very least. So... Here it goes. Well, some of you may be aware that before I started doing YouTube, I was really into building cars. I had a fair-sized collection of project cars that were more or less in storage at a friend's house. Well, that kind of went bye-bye a year ago when uh, she decided to silently move and... Uh, said, oh by the way, you have till the end of the month to clear out the property. That was three days before the end of the month. So we kind of rushed to get everything out of there, and I didn't have anywhere to put it, so most of the cars, which I'll admit do kind of look junky, ended up where I live. And the, uh, neighborhood didn't appreciate that too much, so I've been trying to get all of that project mess that I'm not working on out of here in whatever way possible. And that's been kind of a stressor on me because I am kind of a pack rat of sorts. I don't like to let go of things. And that and they kind of put pressure on me by giving a deadline. And, as odd as this is going to sound, that really didn't sit well with me. Um, I suppose that's not all that confusing, because with a YouTube channel, you set your own pace, you make your own schedules, you're on your own terms. These particular circumstances are not on my terms, so that's where the stress comes in, and a little bit of... Uh, defiant personality, but at the end of the day, I have to buckle down and adult. <laughs> I don't want to, but I have to. That's been going on for at least a couple months, so the stress has been piling up, and I started to notice that it was affecting the quality of my videos. So I was like, I just took a break and now I have to take another one ah! I don't know what I'm saying I'm just spouting words at this point trying to explain what's going on in my head it's so difficult I'm definitely not leaving YouTube I know people are are getting all cross and negative about it and suggesting going up to other platforms, but that seems to bring up something I've dealt with a lot lately, too, is like kind of along the lines of being a late bloomer. It starts making me feel like I, sh I started my channel way too late. It's like at the end of the YouTube life cycle, I'm jumping on as the ship is sinking kind of thing, and that can also affect a lot of shit, but I, at the same time, I want to believe that I've got kind of a mentality of this too shall pass about the whole thing. Uh, it's really hard to wade through all the negativity and, and keep a positive outlook on it. And that's what I'm trying to do right now. Um, 
I'm just dropping a whole lot of heavy stuff on you guys and I don't like that. That's kind of why I stay private all the time and not share this stuff with you is because I don't want to, I don't want anyone to, I want to, I want people to be happy. I want to make people laugh and, and, and be a jokester and not a prankster because those guys are idiots. Maybe I'm just making up stupid excuses for myself and not putting enough effort into it. I worry that I'm, I constantly worry that I'm not putting the effort into this channel that I should be. There's a lot of things that, that kind of go over my head as far as all of this goes, like, like self-promotion and what else do you need to do for a YouTube channel? I don't know, I kind of always said to myself, but I never really explained it outright on the channel, is that I would like the channel to grow through word of mouth as outdated a concept as that is these days and if there's any worth in the channel for somebody to see and and like it and enough to subscribe to then that's my brain just stopped i don't know where that sentence was going where did it go i don't know i'm literally just piecing thoughts together right now i'm so scatterbrained like i said i am um, planning to make my return. I'll make a few videos here and there. I probably won't pick up the intense schedule that I had right before this last break just yet. I'll probably work my way back into it because I want to make sure that I'm not just going through the motions with these videos and that I am actually enjoying the process. And this whole stressful fiasco that's been going on here has kind of sapped that away in a sense so I'm going to try and develop the ideas that have been rattling around in my head a little more so it's gonna be a while before I'm fully back but at the same time I didn't really intend to go anywhere you know the uh, saying communication is a two-way street I need to learn to communicate with you guys more. Be more inclusive with you guys in my ideas and my, my, my projects, whether it be a YouTube video or something else that I'm doing. Like, for example, how many of you guys really know that I like to tinker and have been rebuilding consoles and controllers every once in a while? I will learn to talk more. <laughs> I think that's been the whole goal of this from the get-go. But yeah, I will... I will be more communicative with you guys and... Uh, and try and get more feedback from you guys on ideas and, and share ideas with you guys and... This is probably one of the slowest starting communities ever, and it's my fault. I'll take full blame on that. But we're making progress. And, and progress is always a good thing. Now that sentence got away from me. But yeah, among other things, I've got a uh, couple of project ideas coming up involving green screens and for the moment that's all I'll say about that but keep your eyes peeled and by keep your eyes peeled I mean possibly turn on that little notification bell and I will see you guys in the next video hopefully it'll amaze <laughs>